I think we have been working really hard to change kind of our style of play. So expectations are to come out, kind of show that new style of play of up-tempo to the world. Team expectations are definitely high. I think one thing you've heard from top down is we have depth this year that we lacked last year. Each day in practice has been increasingly competitive. And I think we've worked very di diligently in the training room and in the athletic facility just to get stronger and healthier this year so we can go out there and compete. But to practice every day with 14 players um, is just a, a wonderful gift <laughs> for us to have that um, every day. A lot of new faces that means just better competition in practice. Um, everyone's fighting for playing time but it's ultimately making everyone on the court better. One thing that I love with being a senior is that we have such receptive lower classmen. So whenever we're giving coaching, it's always taken in a positive way. It's always constructive. It's never like she's trying to get on me. So it's been really great to one step up in that role, but have that role be accepted by the rest of your team. Our culture has shifted in, in that we have two feet in two feet in and you can see that from top to bottom, but you can also see that in the leadership of the older ones. So you have these new faces that are walking into this program and they are being led. It's nice to be playing against new faces and to be able to be on, all on the same team. Like I know me and Bree always go against each other every day in practice, but to be together united as a front is going to be awesome. We're excited to have our first home opener at home. Uh, will be great. Uh, we've been working really hard again. and. The past two scrimmages we've had these past two weekends have been so great to see. You know, we scrimmaged a D2 and then we went and did a Pac-12. So it's been really exciting to see the level of competition we can have. In the 40 minutes, regardless of being at sea level or regardless of being in elevation, we hope that 40 minutes of playing an up-tempo style of play will be to our advantage in the, final, um, in the final few minutes of the game or in the second half where we can take advantage of it. One thing Coach has really implemented in us is you're going to get a sub in three minutes. So having that invisible opponent for altitude and getting our out-of-state out teams here, they already feel that when they're in shoot-around and in the first five minutes of the game, like oxygen is thin for them. So having our up-tempo and we are just told to run the floor, do as best as you can, bust your butt for three minutes and you'll have a sub coming in. I love the energy, love the screaming. I know one game we had like a bunch of kids and they were screaming so loud I could barely hear myself. So. If that's what fans bring, I'm loving it. And our kids, they're just great character kids. I mean, they are phenomenal role models for families, young kids, girls and boys. And so I encourage families to come out and, and be with them, be a part of them, get to know them. Yeah.